life and death is tragic as it sounds, and the causes tend to sound frightening. For example, the sudden infant death syndrome, in which the death result is undetermined. This means that the next child could possibly die before they turn a year old. But there is one most common determined cause of death, which is abusive head trauma, or the shaken baby syndrome. That's right. Shaking babies can lead to death, as well as other health problems, nerve and brain injuries, troubles seeing and hearing, and neck problems. Now the reason people shake babies is mainly from unstoppable crying and frustrations of the individuals themselves. 1,200 to 1,400 of these cases happen each year, and 80% of the culprits are men. Moreover, little do some may even realize how dangerous it is to shake a baby. What the people should assume is that babies would not know how to control their own bodies, nor would they learn from being shaken. And what could be worse, their necks could have been broken. In all, suggestions to do while babies can't stop crying include rocking, stroking, feeding, any of those basics. Others may suggest checking illnesses, consulting other people, even a doctor. But whatever people do, they should not grab hold of a baby while they are angry, because they may even start crushing them with their own hands. Or worse, shaking, in which shaking should never be considered, should not be taken lightly, should be by all means avoided. Please support the prevention of this issue. For more information regarding this syndrome, look into the National Center on Shaken Baby Syndrome.